Hello everyone, I'm 9 First Morning Meteorologist Sherry Hughes. Thanks for logging on. Well, we have another freeze warning which encompasses areas from Highland County uh, or Hill Hamilton County southward, southwest portions of Ohio and southeastern portions of Indiana. Temperatures are going to get into the 20s for a period of time before we get back to the 30s by around 7 in the morning. So I'll give it a low of about 28, which will likely come around 2, 3 a.m. in the morning. Then the air will start warming up. Here's our problem. We're going to get a little bit of moisture in here. In fact, we start clear until uh, midnight. We start to see those clouds back out to the west. Then a warm front's lifting over the area. So by 7 a.m. in the morning, we could see a few areas getting a little bit of light snow to our north and then we'll be watching back to the west for the potential of some light freezing rain. It transitions over to rain during the mid morning into the afternoon and temperatures are warming to about 48 50 degrees or so. Let's talk about the potential for that icing. It's very minor right now. Be very careful bridges and overpasses. Our surface temperatures are going to be cold. That warm air is going to be lifting over so it is going to amount to maybe perhaps a little freezing rain. Three hundredths of an inch to five hundredths of an inch possible at best here and it looks like our biggest area of concentration would be Franklin Fayette and Union. Not that we couldn't see a little more elsewhere. Again, it's going to be those higher elevated surfaces that you may need to be really careful like those bridges and such. Uh, mid morning though, everything starts to warm up for us and our uh, chance of ice becomes a chance of just rain. So here's your St. Patrick's Day forecast. We're going to give it about 33 degrees at 7. And remember, we start in the 20s, but temperatures are warming. We'll get to the lower 40s by noon. There'll still be a chance of rain. And even as we get into the afternoon hour around 4 p.m. or so, there's still a chance of a few light showers into the evening hours before we seem to clear things out. Now for the weekend, we're going to be at a high of 47 on Saturday, 50 on Sunday. We'll see more clouds on Saturday, but Sunday is going to be your pick day for the weekend and spring will come in very warm in the lower 60s.